There's a sense of intimacy there that just doesn't exist for the other superheroes. And my feeling is that's true because of all the superheroes. Batman's the only one who's actually not a superhero. There's nothing supernatural about him. He can't fly. He can't see through walls. He's a man. He's a human being. He's like you and me. In fact, he's a very flawed man. He's been damaged by life. And he knows he's flawed. We're all flawed. And we all get beat up by life. So it makes him that much more relatable for us because in a way he's so much like us. What distinguishes him is that no matter what life throws at him, no matter what crisis or disappointment or failure, he doesn't let it defeat him. He doesn't let it make him bitter or angry. He takes the pain that life throws at him and he turns it around and he gives it back to the world as love. Because his whole mission is to leave the world better than he found it. And it's the nobility of that mission. That's what we admire so much about him. It's almost as if that ability to take life's pain and turn it into something positive, it's almost as if that is his superpower. But there's something supernatural about that, is there? Because he does that through force of his will, through his spine, through his belief in himself. So I wanted to share you something from my life. 25 years ago, um, I was diagnosed with a brain infection and I was dying. And I was um, slipped into a coma for a few days. I lost 60 pounds. I stopped working. I couldn't walk. I couldn't, I was, it was over. And I faced um, my mortality and I was angry and I was scared, but I didn't stop fighting. I was a walking x-ray. I was, I was written off. They threw me a 40th birthday party six months early because I was not going to make it to 40 and everyone knew that, but I fought and I fought and I kept seeing a tomorrow. But at the same time, I had to get over my fear of passing because it was very likely that I was going to. I never knew I had the strength that I had to get through that, that year. I didn't know I had that in me. We don't know the strength we have in us until we're challenged. No one does. So never stop believing in yourself, in your ability to fight through this thing, because you don't know what the future brings. And don't be afraid of whatever the future brings. You're loved by the people around you. You're very lucky to have that love and to have that support. But keep believing in yourself. Fight through this. And know that you are loved. It's not who you are underneath. It's what you do. So if you're given 80 years on the planet, make them full. If you're given 40 years on the planet, make them full. If you're given 25 years on the planet, make them full. Make them count. Because none of us know how many years we have. So I'll be rooting for you. 
the same way your friends are rooting for you. Batman believes in you.